Governor Joe Lombardo calling the education budget from state lawmakers unacceptable. He says it doesn't take into account his priorities, and that includes safety measures for schools, more funding for families to choose charter schools. Kim Passoff joining us live with the group stepping in to back him in a big way. Yeah, supporters of school choice are public funding for students who choose to attend charter schools support the governor. Today, one group launched a quarter of a million dollar ad campaign targeting lawmakers who have voted against it. Here is that ad. Las escuelas de Nevada no son seguras. Nevada schools aren't safe. Instead of better grades, our kids worry about gangs, bullying, and shootings. It's time they had options. But Nevada's Democratic leaders are standing in the way. Luckily, Governor Lombardo has a plan that allows parents to send their child to a school of their choice. That is the ad now running on Spanish TV stations throughout Nevada. If you look at the Nevada report card, you see that our kids are not reading at grade levels in all levels and not performing in math. Unfortunately, our communities of colors are the ones that often suffer the consequences of a, of a system that has been self failing us for decades. Valeria Gurr with School Choice Advocacy Group, American Federation for Children, specifically advocates for underserved communities. My mom actually doesn't know how to read. AFC will spend at least $250,000 on television and digital advertisements, calling out Nevada legislators who rejected the Republican governor's school choice proposal. They say a lack of choice is keeping Hispanic families trapped in unsafe learning environments. The only ones that don't have options are the ones that don't have the money to afford it. And who do you think it is? It's the communities of color. Last month, a packed hearing on an education budget bill included debate on school choice. The bill would increase funding for opportunity scholarships to 500 million over the next two years, allowing more low-income families the choice to attend charter schools. Fixing Nevada schools and expanding school choice issues Governor Lombardo campaigned on now are promises he's looking to fulfill. I've been working in the school choice for over a decade. And I have never seen this much momentum. And opponents to increasing funding for school choice include teachers unions. They argue that would take much needed money away from traditional public schools. Reporting live tonight, Kim Passoff, Fox 5 News, local Las Vegas.